get it, get it. I get knocked out of it. Don't watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Who's out there and kill it? It's time to quit. Who's me? Who's just as bad. Um, would never get up, but unfortunately he did. Wise decision, as the results showed. What a boy can do, can do. Internationally famous, is he a represents? Guys, what a real game. April to October. I'm down for everything. The only way I could have beaten Joe is with a baseball bat. With a baseball bat. For a national pastime. Never be equal. Can hear a wonderful stadium and a wonderful crowd. Came the fabulous Swede. Fire Tormer. We had blood American Wood. We'll deal more safely. Here in Germany has been very nice to me. I thought I was going to knock him out in the first round. Careless, I should have knocked him out. Careless, I should have knocked him out. Careless, I should have knocked him out. In spite of the fact that I was hit seven times in succession. Bills the record books. He was just as bad. <laughs> Is concerned. Uh, I can't tell you. Maybe. Part of my professional obligation. My frame won't punch. I think that's just wishful thinking. Carry the ball. Go notes for the United States. Worship. I had a whole lot of shirts along with thousands of. Right up a curtain, small bass. Obligation. Those in. Hit by five. Right up a tenth round and lower calls and a right six round. Small bass. Hit by five. Hold the October. Hit a Swede. Hit a Swede. City trackman. Cosmic part. Again. Seven times in succession, succession, and the succession. I'm still, I'm still. I'm still the heavyweight champion. Notes for the United I, I might add, first of all, that the, the thousands of letters we have received about this thing, requesting information about... The there, is, there is the name. Plastic the haircut. Plastic haircut, right there. Yes. yes. Thousands of letters, you were saying? Well, that boy, for instance, is that a phallic symbol? No. Is, is the head there, or the, is the other... Well, I can imagine that. No. No, it isn't. No. Well, then what was the, what was the stimulus for this film? I mean, the whole, the, the, the feeling, the me not the message, the, the philosophical base in which you approached this kind of uh, uh, a film. I think anyone who would look, who would use their own eyes to watch, for example, mm -hmm. the, the, the man in the hat there with, uh, with his hands red He's signaling. And yes, he is signaling. Oh, he, I, I it is an athletic yes. film. Oh, I, I see. Anyone who watched long enough, I'm sure, would see that it has to do only with boxing. Are boxing you, is, is done, of course, in our country, but more specifically, is done in your country. You mean to say that... That, that there, there was a referee. You saw him. Wave. Uh, it seems that he is nodding no right, right He now. may be he, nodding no, yes. But is he calling the, signals there, at this moment? There is, there is the winner, the champion. He is holding up his hands, wiggling his fingers, signifying what you know, of course. Yes. There is That's very interesting. Do you think this comes from, from a neo-Italian school? Were you influenced by the, the neo-Italian Fellini and, and uh, uh, Antonioni and so on? Have you been influenced by the, the Italian filmmakers? Very definitely, yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Mm. I have enjoyed their movies so very much. Mm -hmm. We've seen them first in Bombay, yes. then Calcutta, mm. then again in Bombay, and then again in... <laughs> <laughs> I, I see what repetition is important. I, I notice this. I notice that in your film, for instance, the great if handling of the black and white space. Yes, now, we, where did you, where, how did you approach that black and white space? Did you approach it, you know, as a painter or as the, as, as the filmmaker? Or did you approach it as, as the creator? <coughs> I think all of us together worked in the approach of black and white space. As you see there, for instance. There was a ball. <laughs> there was a ball. Yes. This was a black and white ball, no? Yes. This, this is the way we approach the black and white space. Here again is a black and white space, a black line on a white space. Uh, this is, this you was say, a, you said, the, you said this, is, this is an athletic stimulus, so you mean to say this, this is an athletic, athletic line. You arrived at that, that's a scrimmage line then. It's a scrimmage line, yes. I see. Hmm. There is the ball, you saw the ball. Yes. 
Right. Now, now, in, in terms of modern cultural phenomena, uh, does this have really socially uh, a social importance? Does this have some consequence in our own daily lives? The only thing I could say to that is please do not think of it in terms of phallic symbols. Why not? Because this is precisely the wrong approach. Right. And if you should once think of these sort of things, mm -hmm. I think it is misleading. Uh, now, now, you see, this, this man is, keeps on re, uh, uh, appearing. Now, but phallically, no. Well, well, what does he symbolize? I mean, if, he, does he, um, does he, is he, can you explain exactly what, what he does well, mean? If you, if you watch very closely, yes. you will see, first of all, that, now, for instance, there, you saw him with glasses on, holding onto the pyramid, banging, yes. scraping, here he is, screaming as it is. The, the, uh, here he is again, holding onto the pyramid. Is this phallic? No, it is not. But the man or the, the, man, or the pyramid? Neither one are phallic. Neither one? Neither. Well, I didn't even ask that question. I was wondering about, uh, one, about the athletic. The, uh, the athletics are very obvious, it seems to me. You mean, it, you mean to say... There's hardly anything that I might add. If you watch, for instance, there are, is an athletic boy and girl yes. together. You yes. saw them a moment ago. Here is an athletic hole on the pyramid. Yes. If you watch closely, at that hole, you'll see he's looking athletically into the hole. I see. Well, it's his energy flowing. Do you feel this is any... any is there is a relationship to the theory of games in, in this whole... Very definitely, a relation to all theory of games. How yes. is that? There again, the girl and boy playing games. I see. There again, a game with the eye looking through the hole, the athletic hole of the athletic pyramid. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. This is then there a very popular... Uh, uh, sport. Uh, sport. <laughs> <laughs> well, can you tell us uh, about how you, uh, how many feet of, of the film did you make? Uh, this is obviously a long or short version of what you shot. This is the total amount of feet that we shot. I see. Directly in this relationship as you see it. That's unique. You mean to say there was no cutting? There was no, no cutting? No. Ah, oh, that's As a matter of fact, there was no edit editing of any kind. The, the footage was made directly from the camera in this very manner as you see it. I see. This is an interesting phenomenon. Did you, did you develop this to your own self and your own studio? No, we sent it to the, uh, for development, we sent it to the laboratories which do a better job than we could. Yes, I see. Now, this explosion here, now, there where the pyramid exploded, and this man now is lying down. What? Yes. I, I mean, uh, uh, that, that's the one section that doesn't, doesn't really... Uh, fit in for me. It seems to jar the senses. Obviously, you have not seen boxing matches no. before. I've seen one or two, yes. You have seen boxing? Yes. Have you seen one opponent defeat the other? Yes. Well, then, of course, the question is invalid. Sound by Steve Reich.